So we've been talking about natural laws in the universe and about repetition. And I've mentioned repetition is a law of nature. So if we can learn the law of nature to do with repetition, we can actually strengthen and power it in us because we will have the assistance of the natural energies to do with repetition. And one of the things we definitely see repetition with is our planet. Yeah, the planet, we can look, it has natural laws to do with repetition, such as uh, the moon going around the planet. And the moon has its phases. You know, it's either like this, or like this, or like this, or it's gone. And it happens every month. And when there's a full moon, it affects the planet by drawing the waters. And when it's gone, there's a different effect. But the planet itself also has its seasons because we get spring and summer and autumn and winter. And the day itself has a cycle where we get the morning and then the daytime and the evening and then the nighttime. So these processes of repetition, we can look at them and notice they have a cycle of four. You know, you see it with a, a caterpillar caterpillar becoming a pupa, becoming a butterfly, and then laying an egg, and then from the egg comes the cycle of four, even our heart. You know, we've got these four little rooms, ventricles, and working to have the circulation of our blood in repetition. So trying to understand that there is a law in nature to do with repetition, will actually cause in us more power to do with doing repetitions. Because it's not always easy, but after you have a good purpose and a reason, and you do something again and again, it only gets easier over time. You know, even the number four, if you look at it, you get this kind of north-south and east-west. And here you get this one line, which is speaking about where we are at the moment. So the number four, and this could be like morning, day, evening, night, spring, summer, autumn, winter. This cycle is something that we can take into ourselves as a power to help us in our decisions. Because things will get hot and they'll get cold, and sometimes they'll be wet and they'll be dry. But all of these things are part of how things work in nature. And you can see it everywhere. I mean, even a deck of cards. You know, if you look at a deck of cards and you see hearts and diamonds and cloves and uh, spades, they're talking about this law to do with four. Because if you trace cards far enough into history, you'll find the tarot. And if you go back with the tarot, you'll get to ancient schools of wisdom that spoke about these things. So another natural law, look for it, make it part of your life, and then get from it enhancement and power for your decisions in repetition.